Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Gaming Guitarist, and I just got my 5-4 club package for this month, so let's take a look at it. Oh boy, what do we have here? Yeah. So let's see if, is it in the frame? Huh. What's this? Hmm. I got a new pair of sunglasses that I unfortunately won't be able to use because it doesn't have my prescription, but maybe eventually I can uh, put them on. I will try them. That's, that was nice of them. Let's see, we've got a uh, long sleeve shirt here. Uh, the thing I like about this long sleeve shirt is, um, this looks like, you know, I always like their shirts, it's good material, feels nice and soft, but, uh, yeah, it is a long sleeve shirt, just double checking, uh, you know, got some stripes, you know, but these aren't, but these look like classy stripes, they don't look like Burton Ernie stripes, even though I like Burton Ernie stripes, uh, the, this is something that I, you'll be able to wear all year long, and I have yet another pair of jeans from them, I, the last time I received a pair of jeans from them, they were black, and this time I've got some, would appear to be some dark wash jeans. Uh, what does it say? Okay, it says. Oh, okay, this is raw denim. Okay, that's interesting. Never owned a pair of raw denim jeans before, so let's see. These jeans. What's that say there? You should be able to read that. They'll evolve each and every time you wear them. Premium denim that tells the story of your, how you move, certainly. Wear them with. Huh. It keeps mentioning to use woolite black. Let your jeans get dirty for as long as possible, and then dry clean, and then soak your jeans for about an hour and with all of it. Huh. Okay, that's kind of... Okay, never would have expected that. Well, anyways, let's try these on, shall we? And I guess this is a signature thing of 5-4 with their jeans, just like my other pair I got back in October. Uh, you've got dollar signs on the inside pockets. Where the... Yeah. Ah. Oh. Oh, damn. The... Okay. Okay. Um... Yeah, see, the thing that I noticed now that I got other pairs of jeans, that these are definitely on the tighter side, because these aren't exact, because, I mean, these feel just a bit tighter than slim fit jeans, but they're not exactly skinny, they're somewhere in between, and I don't, uh, but they feel very stretchy, and I really like uh, stretch jeans, which, and for me, are way more comfortable to wear. And then we can try this on next. Huh. I, I just noticed this here. Something interesting. The back side of this shirt is actually longer than the front. I uh, don't know exactly what purpose that's for, but I'm just uh, okay. So, mm. 
All right, yeah. Yeah, this shirt feels pretty comfortable. But I will say, eh, I'm sure I'll get used to it, but the collar feels a bit tight. And then, of course, we've got the glasses that I will add on later. But let's just put this camera over here. Okay. Put this camera right there. And, uh... And here it is. I can't see shit through these, so this is a true Matt Murdock simulator. Um, mm. But anyways, so these are the jeans. Which the one thing that's that I kind of that's kind I kind of have to nitpick is even though these are a size 30, which is my correct size, the their pants tend to go pretty long. And anyway, so here is the shirt. I don't know, it's like there's something weird about this collar where it feels a bit higher or tighter on my neck than I'm used to with my other shirts, but uh, I'm sure that'll be a thing uh, that well, I can adjust to over time. So anyway, this is the front, and this is the back, and the side, and yep. Yeah. So, anyways. I'm Mr. Gaming Guitarist. If you're new to this channel, you can subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos from me. And you can also watch the um, N4G TV podcast that I host on the N4G TV YouTube channel. And you can also support my channel on Patreon. I would appreciate it. So anyways, thank you for watching this video if you've made it this far. And I will see you next time. Bye.